the one and only Xalophony here with Yu-Gi-Oh! Fight Club. This is gonna be week two of season two, so you guys remember the first rule about Fight Club. Right? I'm, I'm not even gonna say it today. But we are going up against Mario. Now Mario is gonna have a grudge against me, so he's gonna be coming full force. Because I took dinosaurs away from him. And very unfortunately, he still ended up getting rolled to a, uh, another good type. Psychics. Which are apparently very, very good when it comes to pendulums being in the game. So we're gonna have trouble against him. But we have a deck that is tried and true and nerfed and blue. And we'll see how it can do those rhymes. Anyway, the only changes we've made, we've uh, made sure to take out the breakthrough skill. Because from the little bit I've seen of his deck, a lot of the monsters don't even have effects. So I'm not gonna, you know worry about that is the biggest issue and I believe I also took out the bottomless trap hole so I can get myself a solemn strike and a dimensional barrier because we're going up against a lot of pendulums and I'm trying to figure out how to counter pendulums I'm still learning but we're gonna see if I can make it happen with this deck let's get into that duel welcome back everyone to the Yu-Gi-Oh Fight Club I am here with Xylophone you mean the dirty Xylophone because you took away dinosaurs from me so you're still mad about that? I could have had the new dino support that's so good. But you good. got metal foes. That's good, right? It's not the best without the full support. It needs a different archetype to make it really good. Oh, all right. So I have a chance is what we're saying. Yeah. <laughs> it was either this or side frames. All right. Well, let's see. I am running an Atlantean deck, but I think I'm still going to go first because if you're... If you got all kinds of pendulums in there, I kind of want to stop them. And I got just the thing to stop them. Oh, is it is it the advice I gave you during the learning pendulums deal? Pfft, nope. Uh, just gonna set this card in my turn. <laughs> Alright. What do you got, I'll sir? I'll set this in the pendulum zone. Oh, do you already got the two? Not yet. Okay. Set these two down. Then I'll have to end. Oh, okay. All right, let's see if I can draw something actually usable. What? I thought I took this out of my deck before this. Oh, well, it's not bad. It's just not what I was expecting. All right, well, let's get Mirror Force, shall we? Let's flip up this guy. And let's go ahead. Ooh, do I want to do this effect? I could. Yeah, this could be fun. I will go ahead and set this down. And I think I can do a thing. Let's see. Yeah, let's do a thing. I'm going to... Oh, it's not a good thing, now. I should save it. Yeah, I should save it. Alright, we're just going to uh, go ahead and normal summon our Atlantean Marksman. Because I'm 90% sure I'm about to get Mirror Forced anyway. So. Ooh, I can special something summon. I could actually use one of these guys. Da -da 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 -da. And once per turn, I can detach a card and target a water monster I control, and it can attack. Nope. I don't need that. You crazy? All right, let's go <laughs> for some attack, shall we? Uh, let's attack with the little guy first. Marksman. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. It is <laughs> Quaking. Worse. Okay. End my turn. Quaking is one of the better ones, I've, in my opinion. Yeah, I think I got two of them in, the, in this deck, just because like when you got a thing that doesn't have all the right support you want, it's like Quaking's just a good filler card. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to do a bit of a risky play. All right. Let's see it. Come on. So I'm going to set these two cards, but Ooh. I'm going to activate Twin Twister, discarding Ooh. this Ooh. to destroy not only this, but one of my own cards. Because when one of my own cards is, is destroyed, I can activate Metaphor's Counter and Special Ooh. Summon. That's, that's sharp. This... Ooh. But, not only that, when uh, Metaphor's Fusion is in the grave, I can put it back Ooh. in the deck and draw a card. Okay. Nice work, man. Yeah, I've been learning. I've been trying to learn this deck to the bone, trying to get, trying to be ready for this. <laughs> yeah. All right. That's good, man. Oh, I'm going to need to draw something good. I've had such a bad hand in this game. I was straight up bluffing at the beginning. No oh no, reason. you think your hand was bad? I didn't yes. start off with any yes, monsters. Yes, I do in my think hand. my hand was bad. <laughs> <laughs> I started with all monsters in my hand. <laughs> so, oh. You at least had a pendulum in your hand. That's still a monster. I drew into it. <laughs> uh, 
right. by the way by the way the uh I love how breakthrough skill is in the deck, but at the same time, most of my monsters while on the field, normal. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. All right, Pot of Duality. Yeah, that's the thing. Breakthrough skill, I thought I took it out. Uh, I was because like, right, I see a lot of normal dudes. Not so, going to be that useful against me. Yeah. Like, I didn't like look into your deck to see how many effects there were, but I was like, ooh, normal cards? There's probably... Okay, I see a couple normal cards, so breakthrough skill is not going to be the sharpest card I got. But... So I took it out, and now I guess I didn't save my deck. Or my deck didn't save something. All right, so I can send a card to the graveyard. It's going to be the Dragoons. We're going to set up our hand a little bit here. You you might have just done the quick, you know, you thought you hit save, or maybe yeah, save bad. Yeah, it's quite possible. Because it's been a long day for me. So, let's see. And to the hand. Oh, do we want to go safe, or do we want to go big? Let's mm. see. Well, you got that right now, so let's go safe. Get Deep Sea Diva in case we need to drop that out. And I will set one card. Your move, sir. Hmm. Alright. I really wish I could have flipped my card up, but quaking. So. Yeah. Good old quaking. Hmm. Eh? Yeah. Let's no. attack. Since no. I won't. No. I don't. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. Since you don't want. Since I don't want you having the prince in the, on the field. Smart, smart. Fun little fact, I was so tired one of the days, and I said, oh, isn't that a princess? And I was like, what? Yeah, <laughs> everyone calls it a princess, just because it's, dude's got the hair. But it's no one first, it's the called name. a prince! <laughs> and, I, and I guess my first thought was, look at those abs! And I was like, I guess some women can rock abs like that, and you just kind of have that inwards frame. But, I don't know, I see a dude. But I, I can guess see, I can everyone see what the confusion is. I think it's because no one ever ho hovers over the card. They always see, like, the preview art on the card. Yeah, 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 yeah. So All from right. afar, it looks like it's a girl. <laughs> yeah, I'm really going to be digging deep here. All right, Deep Sea Diva. Ah, digging deep. Ah, ah. <laughs> All right. Uh, still mad at you for dinos. <laughs> All right, you got a lot of cards on the field there. Um, so I think I'm going to continue setting up and hope you don't kill me next turn. So, we're gonna do so that. how was it without the mermail support, though? It's so bad. Nah, it's, it's better than I thought it would be. I thought it was just going to be garbage, but it's usable. So let's go ahead yeah. and send... Of course, my dragoon, my other Dragoons is in my hand, so I can't use that combo. Um, but what oh, I can no. do... You know what? Do we play it safe or try to get an early advantage? I'll let you pick. Mm, safe. Okay, I'm going to uh, go ahead and send a Besidra the Atlantean Dragon to my grave. And to my hand, I will pull out a Call of the Atlanteans. Okay. All right. And now, ooh, I can activate this now? Oh, it doesn't have to be face up? Sweet! All right, well. To what, tune? Uh, no, to use my Poseidra's effect. You're about to find out what that does. We are going to activate a Poseidra from the hand to get rid of our Marksman, Diva, and Prince and get Solemned. But this also lets me bring out a second Poseidra, the one I just sent to the grave, oh. and I get to destroy one of your face downs. Let's go with that fresh one. Uh. Oh yeah, it doesn't matter. They all go back to your hand, so. And you lose attack points. See what I did? Yeah, I saw. <laughs> I did good things. All right. And uh, now, let's see. That was already my summon. So I'm going to set one card and let's go in for some attacks because the field looks nice and clear for me right now. But who knows and next time. And pendulum is destroyed. It goes to the extra deck. Yeah. So I can summon later. But as long as you don't got two pendulums, it's going to be harder to bring those out. So you could still draw into something good here. I'm activating Metaphor's Counter from the Grave, just so I can grab that back to my hand. Oh, nice. Very nice. Okay. So I got damage out here, but you ain't at it yet. So, that's good. And I would totally Xy into something, but the only Xy's for level 7 are Mermails, so I couldn't get them. Yeah. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and end the turn. Alright. Depending on what you do here, I might be okay. Looking at my options right now. Hmm. Oh, wait. I'm scared. 
Yeah, like I got the ability to bring some power to the field, and if your deck moves slow, like what yours is seeming to do right now, I can actually have a chance. So. Hmm. And I got effects I to deal with little problems. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna activate my Metal Force Fusion. Oh boy, you can do that from your hand. Or fuse yep. things from your hand, that's cool. Next, I'm going to... Yeah, I think that's the only option, actually. <laughs> Okay. Use you and one of you and one of you. Oh, jeez. Hello. Crimson Knight. Then Ooh. let's activate one fusion from oh, here. Oh, yeah, you can. And draw an extra card. Nice. I might as well place you in the pendulum zone then. Okay. Yeah, no effect, but might as well get yourself set up. Mm hmm. Alright, so you got more attack points than me. Yep. Mirror Force, right? Nah. It's just the call of the Atlanteans I had put down last time. Ah. Uh, then I'll end. Which should theoretically help me out here. So, let's go ahead and activate this on your turn. Get some dudes back. Let's get Neptibus. Let's get Marksman. And I guess we'll double Neptibus this turn. Actually, I could have done something a little smarter, but it's okay. So, let's go ahead and get you out. Let's get you out. And let's get you out. Yay, little dudes. <laughs> Alright. You don't have, yeah, if I remember correctly, you don't have that much access to, like, a lot of Sea Serpent XYZs, huh? Nah, and the ones I do have, like, I have access to a couple, but they're not good, so. Are they in your deck? Um, yeah, they're in, the, like, I stuffed the side, the extra deck with everything I could, but there's only, like, one I'm ever gonna use, to be honest. There's, like, three maybes in specific situations. Um, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and activate that Besidra from the... Ooh, wait, no, we're not. We're gonna set some cards first. So his effect will go into full action. Because when there's at least four spell and trap cards on the field, they all get sent back to your hand and you're gonna lose some attack points. So as long as this ain't, ain't a Solemn on the field, which I assume if it was, you would have used it last turn, then this is gonna be good. And I can also go ahead and bring out more stuff, so... Let's get your boy here onto the field, and, oh, I get to activate his effect. Well, if they're all about to be destroyed, it's not going to matter anyway. Yeah, and that'll be the game, I'm thinking. Yeah, it's just your side just I didn't get the, like oh. I said, I didn't get the, get, I didn't get the biggest setup, but... And I get to clear your hand out a little bit. So, not a bad round for me, not going to lie. So let's just go ahead and take these guys out, because that's going to be round one. Unless you got another counter in the grave or something. Nah. Okay. I, I'm i just going to tell you this now. I had a second mirror force on the field if you didn't keep clearing it. Woo! I was clearing <laughs> that thing for good reason, man. Uh, I'm so glad that it actually... Well, I guess mirror force is when I attack, too. So that's a yeah. good thing. So I can... If, if I, I do manage to... Do, if you had one card on the field, you would have been fine. But you had the two, so I was like, yes. All right. Uh, so that means... I can find this breakthrough skill and take it out. Yeah, it didn't adjust at all. Okay, that's fine. I'll just re-edit the stuff now. I, I won the game, so I'm in decent position. Get that breakthrough skill out of here. Uh, you doing any side decking differently? Yeah, I'm doing some side decking. Okay. Let's see, you're not going to really use that one. Aside from that, yeah, I think just switching that out for different types of counters is all I really needed. So, I'm complete. Side decking error. Oh, I got 41 in here. What do I need to take out? What is still in here? A what? Let's see, that's out. And is the breakthrough skill not out of here? Dude, wait, wait, what's going on? If you have 15 cards in your side deck, you can't yeah, put I any know. in I there. need to have exactly 15, huh? Where did, oh, I put both of those in. That's what I did. Okay, side decking complete. Gotta throw mm. in that cheeky dimensional barrier, you know? I'll go second. Okay. I still like going first. I mean, since this deck's certainly not as OTK oriented as if it had mermails, so I'm okay with this. Um, yeah, this is going to be a good first round. I'm going to drop out the Deep Sea Diva. Always a good thing to have in your hand early. Because mm -hmm. then I can uh, get a Neptibus out here and start setting up. And I don't have any of my, you know, other <laughs> nasty guys in my hand, too, so. I should have put them in defense, but it's not really a big deal. You're just going to kill stuff anyway. And we can go ahead and send Dragoons to the grave. And to my hand, we're going to, yeah, do it. Atlanteans. 
And this time I'm feeling a little more confident. So we are going to go ahead and grab ourselves a moving glacier. Okay. And I'm going to huh, set a card. And aside from that, that's probably going to be my turn. Uh, actually, yeah, let's do this. I'm going to activate a more ray of greed. Why not, you know? Put these two guys back into the deck. They're not one's good, but they're not super important. And I drew the same card again anyway. Okay. And, well, you got one plus. <laughs> yep, exactly. So I just got two free uh, cards. I'll take it. And the one card, the other card I put back in my deck, it's fine. I'll Thank know. you. Oh, no. I got my field spell. Uh oh. When a metal first card off. is in your pendulum zone. Let's see. Are unaffected by your opponent's card effects. Oh, no. Yeah, so if I had this before, you wouldn't be able to lower my monster's attack points. <laughs> yeah. And is that spells and traps? All of card effects. <laughs> so let's say I got a Solemn on the field right now. I don't know if that would work. <laughs> okay. Totally a Solemn on the field, so. Then I'll special summon. Oh, boy. This is gonna be bad. Let's try it. Why not? Yay! That's not bad, but it's er it's early. Okay. You got something else in your hand to replace that? Oh. Oh. Ooh. Okay. Okay. Yep. That's nice. Wanna do this? <laughs> it's enough. Nope. Oh. I'm not even naming it for that. You want it to be destroyed so you can activate your counter. I can't activate the counter, but oh. I can activate her effect. What's going on? So that I can set this and in the turn, but during the end phase, because she was destroyed by battle, yeah. I can add this to my hand. Ooh, okay. Let's see what we can do here. Alright. I think what we're gonna do... I don't have any major play here, but we can start off by dropping an activation of Neptibus here. And to the graveyard, we're gonna do the old... Send the Dragoons in so we can get my hand all full of good cards. And we're going to add to our hand... Uh, let's grab a Poseidra. Already? I mean, I didn't have any at all, so it's like, yeah, I'm gonna need one, aren't I? Because all my plays rely so heavily on it. And what else can we grab? I suppose we'll get ourselves a, uh... Huh. Yeah, let's double down. Another Mullen Glacier. Alright. So... Let's see if we can do things. Oh boy. Twin Twisters. Now I'm hoping this won't prompt your Metal Foes counter. I don't know if it will or won't. We can send Poseidon to the grave because I can still summon him from there. Okay. Nope. That's good. Now I can go ahead and let's see what's in the grave. I'm going to try to get these Molen Glaciers out here if I can. I don't think I... I think I can. I think I can. Okay. So let's go ahead and... Normal summon. Let's see. Yeah. We're gonna normal summon our boy Atlantean Heavy Infantry. And that'll let us normal summon another monster. And now from the great oh geez, Mario, this is gonna be good. Okay. So now we can Poseidra to get Neptibus. Um Heavy Infantry. You don't have any set cards, but you know, might as well get that. And Deep Sea Diva has served her purpose. So we'll get your boy Poseidra out here. And I can get myself a Dragoons from there as well. Oh, I can take out that with this, of course. So let's get rid of your Metamorphomation. Ah, oh, darn it. I s oh, it's three. Okay, darn it. I didn't want to send those back to your hand. Oh, well. Um, but now... No! If I didn't summon the Dragoons, I would have been fine and able to pull out all these Mullen Glaciers and probably it finished you right here and then. 
Because right now I got four monsters. Yeah, four monsters in the grave. And I don't have anything else to adjust it. Okay. We're going to go ahead and set one card. And go for some attacks. Chip you down as much as I can right now. Uh, you do have the counter still, though. So you're going to wait for some proper moment. And do that. Oh, Jesus, so close. <laughs> Honestly, I, I think uh, I think Zoo, when he said which one he was banning, I think he gave you the stronger of the two. I think he, he definitely took away the stronger of the two, but if he took away Atlanteans, I would have had no support for the other thing. So. Yeah. So I'm, I'm much better off for just having this one rather than them just having Mermails, because that would be a really... Well, I don't know for sure, but I feel like that would be a really tricky situation. But now you got a hand, so I gotta be careful. Yep. Then let's activate you. Oh man. That one's an eight. Activate you. Some someone's coming out. An eight and a one? Yeah, you got something. Special. Ooh. Oh yeah. He comes out as well. Then I normal summon her. All right. No then I'll activate. Anything. Cool. Do that. Oh, what's that do? So that it can special. So that Darn. way it can place. Oh, place. Mm -hmm. uh, Attention, Mario. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. Can activate that. Alright, so can you not play that this turn? Nah. But it's quick play, so you can play it on my turn, can't you? Yep. Hey, very nice. Okay. Now I can't do anything... Oh, wait. Then let's activate you. Okay. So that Jeez. again gets... Ah, oh, darn it. That's good. I still don't know what exactly what that counter does, but it's good, isn't it? <laughs> well, the card's destroyed. <laughs> yeah, you get okay. something else out, is that it? Yeah, All any right, card. Nice. Yeah, so you get something stronger. Because right now you're at an attack disadvantage, but you can easily switch that around, can't you? Yep. All right. End phase. Do I do this? No, there's really not much of uh, no, that's not gonna work. Okay. Hold on. Eh. Alright, well, you did make it so there's five in my graveyard, so I can pull out my Mullen Glacier. Um, however, it's not gonna do a ton of difference here. I wanna, like, get one of these guys on the field, but I don't think this will. Yeah. So I can't really do that, per se. And. I'm just saying a bunch of things that don't necessarily make any sense to you. But let's go ahead and special summon Mullen Glacier. And I will get that card out of your hand. Might as well activate it now, then. Okay. I'm assuming you're going to use the card in your hand for material for that, or... No? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. What does this guy do? You want to just tell me his effect? Basically, uh, you ch there, it's a quick play effect. Uh, I can target any of your monsters during either player's, during your turn actually, and mm -hmm. equip it to my monsters and equip spell, and he gains a defense, and gains a defense points equal to its attack. Oh, okay. Once a turn, I'm assuming? Mm-hmm. All right. Let's set this card, and I think that makes my choice very clear here. To attack with, to attack squad, right? Because then I can take him out next turn. So let's try that. If I'm thinking my way around this properly. I don't know if your silence means- Oh, you can select him! Okay. Yep. Nice. And there's a quick play, so you can't stop your attack. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Life points are life points. Um, okay. That's really good. I like it. Uh, I think I'm going to go ahead and end my turn with that, actually. Because, yeah, I don't know how to fight that. And is that all he can do? Just get himself some super high defense? 
Yeah, it's just mainly taking away your strongest monsters away from you. And okay. since it's not in your grave, you can't reset your the uh, spell and trap card zone. Yeah, I would have liked that. And I'm assuming you can do that on my turn again next turn? Yep. That is nice. I like it. All right, um, we're going to go ahead and end the turn there then. Yeah, that puts you in a real good position because I don't have a lot that can defeat that. Hmm. Let's see. What I need to do is draw another uh, Poseidra. Okay, so I'm going to special summon these two in defense. Okay. Um. Let's see. Honestly, I don't see a better time to Solemn here, so let's go ahead and use it now. Because I like ah. that double kill. You might have been planning something bigger that I could have done a little something more, but I am i don't know. I don't know, so I'm going to take the safer option there and just get rid of those two. How long were you sitting on that card? <laughs> uh, not long. Because didn't I use another one like earlier in the game? Yeah, that was the second Solemn I've had. So it wasn't sitting yeah. that long. Yeah, yeah, I was unlucky that you activated on your full meadow, so probably because of your metamorphic case yeah, or something. Probably. Yeah. Oh, because it's a quick. Oh, because it's because it's. Uh, I think it's because it's a quick play. You couldn't do anything. Oh, uh, that makes sense. Okay, sure. Hmm. You got anything else? Or are you just defending? Because it's a strong defense, and you can take out all of my offense. Is the thing. Yeah, I'm I'm aware. I'm just trying to figure out what I want to do, though. <laughs> yeah, you don't have a lot of offensive options from what it looks like. But yeah, it would have been it would have been better if this was in a uh, attack mode. Like if I could just gain attack equal to it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I'll just have to end. All right. Well, you're gonna get Prime and Glacier away here. Um, darn it, that's also not what I need. Oh man. Yeah, what I'm going to do here is just uh, activate a pot of duality. I got other plays I can make where I could special summon, but they're not going to beat it, so. Um, hmm. That's not going to cut it. That's not going to cut it. I guess what we're going to do. Huh. All my stuff is like, no, I have a play, but it's not going to help me here. Um. Yeah, I guess I... Might as well just get salvage. And drop that on the field. Go ahead and get the deep sea diva back to my hand. Oh, let me guess. You can get another uh, Poseidra, but at the same time, even if you were to reset the field, I can just take the Poseidra again. Better. Here's what's about to go down. You're going to like this and hate it at the same time, I think. Oh, I know what you're about to do. Take it, take it away. <laughs> you knew exactly what I was about to do. You're Bri Brionic, right? That's, That's a sea the serpent. one. That's the <laughs> one. Darn it. And I can't, still can't destroy you. Um. Oh, man, you're in such a good position. Oh, God. Because I was reading levels of wait, wait. What card was unbanned? So what I should have unbanned? attacked first, baited you, and done that. Actually, I wouldn't have activated it anyway. You would have just ran right into it. Yeah, true. Fair enough. You're right. Point. <laughs> You're right. I couldn't have baited you if I wanted to. Um, you would have just taken life points. Yeah. I got nothing. Um, might as well keep him in attack mode. So that's that. Oh man, and you're just drawing. I needed that Bryonic. Hmm. I really don't like how you seem to have like a, every time I'm about to do a big play, you have like a spell of trap. So I'm gonna activate this. Smart. And get rid of Can your I stuff. This one? Oh, okay. Yeah, there's a quake. Oh, that was a good call. <laughs> it was. And you already remember what Metaphor's Fusion does in a grave. I don't, but I assume you um, send it back to your deck and draw a card. <laughs> <laughs> that's what it, that's a lot. What it looked like. Still defense game. Honestly, uh, defense game works for you. You just need time. Yeah. But at the same time, you could possibly draw something that could potentially help you. I could, you. but I have a very difficult... I'm in a very difficult place to do that. 
I Bizarre. guess what I what I can do is do this. I'll summon this. Okay. Activate. Do that. Oh, I must have used all my counters already. Oh, uh, I guess so. Do this. All right, fusion must. And then when that's done, Metaphor's counter. And yeah, bring. Now, now you might get an offensive move out here, huh? Possibly. Yeah, the uh, the Alka Hest is so good. I can't, like that's the thing. I can draw things. I can counter you, and I could counter you, but you can just stop me from doing that. Is the thing. Because you just take take me. Yeah, and then oh, I'll just you. Oh, jeez, yeah, you got the setup right there. Nice. Yeah, just in case you get past Alka Hest. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I might as well just do some life points. Lower you down. Yeah. Plus, you know, it's not a bad play. So yeah, I gotta get something on the field next turn. Oh wait, no, I can just attack you. That's right. Cool. Yeah, whatever. Dirty. Uh, yeah, kill him and not get baited. Mm. Yeah, I figured. You can just bring him back next turn. Doesn't make a difference. Yeah, it's All just right. 100 right now. Uh, I'd rather just save it. Oh, wait, you can just activate it but... at the end of my turn, too, can't you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I... It's a quick play, so I can activate it at any point. Well, I will set a monster and end my turn. Oh. Let nice. me have that monster, Zylo. Of course. Be my guest. Now let's activate you. Okay. And... Hmm. Yeah. Let's do this. Not gonna so lie. they can bring this back. I'm really banking huh? on some heart of the cards right here. <laughs> Didn't respond. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, I guess there is a card that can help me here. Okay, I can take him. 300 attack points. What's the little guy gonna do? <laughs> this? Send it to the grave. So that I can get a Metaphor's fusion. Oh, dear. Another fusion thing. Oh, you got the tough guy. Okay, he might be able to break this defense. Then... Let's do this from the hand and extra deck. Oh man. Oh, you can summon an end to the effects. That's cool. Yeah. Then let's activate Metal Force Fusion. And let me show you a card that actually destroyed Dan. <laughs> okay. It might. Oh, and when this is done. I must say, you might have won this round. I'm just going to throw it out there. Oh, it does, especially since this guy can do piercing damage. <laughs> he has zero defense points! <laughs> yeah, well, double piercing, actually. Double? Oh, that's mean. That's mean. Yeah. <laughs> if I had summoned Neptibus, he would have just taken control of him, so. Oh, third round! Okay. That full metal Alkahest, that is nasty. Oh, yeah. It stops your plays, and even if you were to reset the spell and trap card zone like you do, I can just mm -hmm. take another one. <laughs> yep. Alright, I'm ready to go in. I'm just putting in one, one other one. Yeah, I was thinking like, ooh, maybe breakthrough skill just for him, but it's like, nah, that's extremely specific. And plus, even if you negate his effect, I would still have the monster equipped. Okay. So I'm not gonna lie though, decent hands these last two games. I got another deep sea diva, so I can certainly be happy about that. Go ahead. Nothing too crazy to be seen here. I'll pop him in defense mode this time, cause why not? <laughs> they both have nothing. <laughs> And we'll send you away and get two cards. First one is going to be, let's make it, aw, oh, I, I have, never mind, I have one of the Atlantean Dragoons in my hand, I hate that. Um, but one thing I can do is, nah, it's risky, risky, risky. So let's just be normal here, get a call to my hand, not gonna do anything too crazy. Probably and smart. 
here. We're going to, uh, let's see, to our hand. I still want to make a Mullen Glacier play on you, but the Poseidras are much more effective. So let's grab a Poseidra. Yeah, Mullen Glaciers, you don't need your cards in your hand. So, <laughs> yeah, I'm worried about uh, your cards on the field is the thing. So um, we can now go ahead and let's see, that's not going to do nothing. So we'll go ahead and set this card and attack you direct now. <laughs> End my turn. <laughs> Scariest attack ever. I was so good though taking a deep sea diva. I was so good I would have bionic you in a second. Yeah, I kinda saw that place like way why is he sounding confident? Why is he sounding I got confident? real confident? You knocked me down a peg real quick. I love it. <laughs> uh at least I got my pendulum scales. Oh, you got the full setup? For now. Go ahead, summon multiple monsters, do it. Bring them all out. Okay, do this. Do that. Come on, both of them. Two pendulum monsters. Nah, I don't. I can't. Ah. <laughs> okay. Oh, uh, you have a solemn, don't you? <laughs> no. Of course not. Oh, but you have a counter, and you're gonna attack my deep sea diva. Don't you? I wish. Oh, okay. Then this. Okay, you're doing. That. Oh, you're so you're about to have a counter, is what you're saying. <laughs> Is that what you're saying? I don't recall all the specific effects of these guys. I know that's one of the effects that one of them does, though. Since I know what card kind of counters you, I think I know what I need to do, so... That's smart. That's smart. Let's get this on the field. Yep. I love it. I'm just gonna say, I am not using the Solemn for anything but him. I don't care what you put on the field. It's not gonna be that guy. All right. All right, let's see what I can do now. Um, I don't have any major plays here. I got a funny play. I can do some life point damage to you. Actually, no, you don't have any monsters. So I might as well just do the smarter life point play. Um, let's go ahead and go like so. Yeah, let's just, actually now, let's, just so we don't have anything too crazy happen to us, let's go ahead and use the effect. What do we want to send to the graveyard? Probably beside you, right? Yeah, let's do that. And to the hand, we can get ourselves. You know what? I didn't do the, oh, I can't pull a Mullen Glacier right now. I was about to say, I want to get a Mullen Glacier, but nope. Uh, <laughs> let's see another one of these. All right, let's start setting and setting. And what we're gonna do now is actually no, I got plays. I got plays. We're gonna normal summon. We're gonna go ahead and bring out the. Pos oh darn it! I shouldn't activate the one from the hand. Now I'm only gonna have one Poseidon on the field. Oh well. Nope. All right. I still get his effect though, or at least. Oh wait, no, that actually works out. All right. So now that I have a Poseidon in the graveyard, I'll use Neptunus's effect on him. Accidentally putting him in defense mode because I misclick. Oh, no. <laughs> Darn it. They're just cheeky little misclick. That's all that is. <laughs> this is what it is. Meant to put it in attack mode. Would have got some damage off on you. Oh, well. Let's uh, suffer. Yeah, let's suffer real hard. Um, let's put that down as well. And How many mirror forces is there? <laughs> Twelve. <laughs> Four mirror forces on a solemn. But there's five cards. Nope. I don't care. To be fair, you could be that person who just packs so many mirror forces. I mean, I'm packing two mirror forces and three solemns, so it is what it is, you know? I'm not playing clean out here. Oh, man. You got counters, you got fusions. Then let's replace the one I just used. Whew. And now you can bring the squad out, huh? Oh, yeah. Okay. Make it happen. So you in attack. You in defense. Okay. Take him. Punish me for my misclick. <laughs> that that could be any of them a mirror force, so. Eh, I'm not going to use it, though. I like Poseidon in the graveyard. That means I can do the same move again. <laughs> I 
All right, what else you got? Okay. Let's drop our call of the Atlanteans. Do-do-do-do-do-do. Literally going to be the exact same play again and try not to fail this time. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's go for that. Let's go for that. And let's go for that. Uh, let's see. Twin Twisters. Yeah. Yeah. Get rid of a nice little Poseidra here, and... Oh, look, a Metal Force Counter. And, oh, look, a Metal Force Fusion. Let's get rid of those. Guys. How's it feel? Hmm. Could be worse. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Try to play it cool, then it's like, no, no, really, that's the worst possible thing you could have done to me. I'm really upset with you right now. All right, <laughs> now we're going to see if we can double Poseidra this turn. I'll get two Poseidra? Yep. Because that effect... Was that? And right now would have been the time time for another uh, solemn. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately though, you got monsters on the field, so I can't carve into you like a Thanksgiving turkey. Um, but I can summon. And now we'll set all these cards back in different order, so you don't know which one the solemn is. <laughs> you know? What? Uh, yeah, let's actually just do that. Keep the card in my hand in case I drop another twin twisters. Um, and let's see what we got in the. Okay, yeah, let's just go for some things here. Let's uh, start by slapping him around. Uh, you got, let's see, 2100. I guess we're gonna have to use the big guy. Thing is, though, if you get another pendulum set up, you got, you got a field just sitting right there. Mm. <laughs> But that's, you gotta do something big next turn though, or else you could be in trouble. This has been a good duel. I like it. Yeah, it's not a good, quick one. Good little setup, yeah. So hopefully you guys uh, in the audience are enjoying this right now. Yeah. Oh, so and uh... You actually do have Pendulum set up because I just sent it back. Oh, what, can you activate yeah. that from the grave? Uh, no. Oh, you can shuffle yeah. it into your deck and draw a card. I remember that one. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Do I want? Yeah, I want to do that actually. Counter. Get Add you back. Me. Okay. I mean, couldn't you have to special summon them by doing your pendulum setup anyway? No, because it's a level one. Unless it's oh, a rank. Unless have, it's a scale okay. zero. I see you. Cool. And does scale zero exist? It I'm does, curious. but it's okay. very specific archetype. Yeah, I imagine that's a little more rare. Okay. I almost hit the wrong thing. <laughs> Ooh, end turn! <laughs> You've done that more than once, I know that. <laughs> oh yeah. I just misclicked in this duel of Fight Club. You're making this uh, Solemn look real sweet right now. I'll tell you that much. Not doing it though. <laughs> Could have dropped all those to the graveyard. You ain't getting those back. Then let's normal summon you. <sighs> so that I can have a target. To get rid of, then you can start playing your games here. Yep. Oh, this is a nerve-wracking one, man. I got this power on the field, but you got a full field right now. Yeah. I know what um, card I want to draw, and I want to draw it really badly. I guess, of all things, yeah, let's just keep the fear on the field. Do it, man. You should totally go ahead and, and attack while you're at it, too. Nah, I'm just kidding. Don't attack. I don't even know, I don't even know which direction I'm bluffing you in right now. I'm not going to lie. Oh, what's he do? Defensive monster. Once per turn, it gains attack or defense. Oh, okay. But during each of the players' step, while an attack involving your monster is occurring, you can discard a card, and you can't be destroyed by battle, no battle damage. Yeah, that's a good wall right there. Nothing I want to use this Solemn on, though. Imagine I just don't have a Solemn and I've been bluffing it this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> that would totally would. be a me thing to do as well. It would be. <laughs> 
but at the same time, I know you don't lie that often, so... Yeah, because I gotta save it up for the right moments. I'm so good at it, is the thing. So... Then I actually really wanted Dragoons to stay on the field. Because then if I had drawn a specific monster, I could have just attacked you directly. Yeah. Okay. That's all I can do, so I'm just gonna end. Sure. And when oh, that's activated, you need to discard to activate. Uh, yeah, you do have a card in your hand. Never mind. <laughs> I wasn't like, you going. You don't have I anything. Just, <laughs> if if I didn't, if I knew I wasn't going to get a card in my hand, I would have just kept the two monsters out for more. You're defense. right. You're right. <laughs> All right. Uh, okay. Let's drop a salvage. I'm not a. I'm not a foolish man, Zylo. <laughs> Says you. Um, let's go ahead and get <laughs> Deep Sea Diva and yeah. Let's just grab a Neptibus back. Who knows how long this duel is going to go. Hey, these are, these are not short. <laughs> yeah. No, it's because neither of us have, like, crazy decks right now, so it's good. I like it. Yeah. Um, oh, imagine I was, still, imagine I was still running <laughs> raccoons. <laughs> <laughs> That's always fun. Let's see. All right, so I can go ahead and special summon someone in here. Oh, um, fun fact. It's one thing they keep glossing over. Since I was in the top four, they yeah. couldn't just ban my... Since I had no archetype, the only the only thing yeah, they just banned up the me. raccoon. I'm like, do we really have to? But what if someone else gets beast? Like, what are they gonna do? <laughs> it's not even that good. It's just he got lucky and played well at the same time, you know? Yeah, I knew how to use the deck. <laughs> uh huh. Um, let's see. Do I want to do something real scary or what? Nah, I'm but just gonna. To be fair, up. they needed to ban something since I was on top top four. So. <laughs> yeah. I don't know, you did good last season. Alright, to the graveyard. We're gonna send a... Hmm. Now nah, we're gonna do a Poseidra. I was like, ooh, I could do some plays. <laughs> nah, let's be safe. Speaking of being safe, let's attack that back row of yours. <laughs> That'll be fun, right? <laughs> um, and let's go ahead and get one of those again. Because why not? No, let's go ahead and attack anyway. See what you got back there. Another, another, uh, the thing? No, you don't have it. Okay. Hmm. Do you want to do it? That's the question. I want you. Well, I guess you don't know if I'm lying or not. So, not really much a point in me saying anything. Nah, just doing this. Darn it. Oh, okay, good. Perfect. That's good. All right. Um, let's see, because, ah, uh, no, never mind. Let's go ahead. And oh, actually, oh yeah, duh, that's why. And oh, I can't do that. Never mind. I thought I had a sick play here. I didn't. Uh, yeah. And I thought I was baiting you. I had my turn. Oh man, the tension! High tension duel. <laughs> I love it. Even the dogs oh, yeah. are loving it, man. Everybody's loving it. My dog, there's we have a cat problem, and he's excited, kind of man. He dog. likes duel. He likes a good duel. <laughs> oh, I'm actually gonna do something else, actually. Okay, let's see what you got. So I'm going to special summon my other Volflame. Cool, cool. You got a good little hand right there. Good little field. Because now I can overlay both Ooh. level sevens. They're gonna be good, aren't they? And, to Cybeast Diablos. Do? You can detach it, look at your opponent's extra deck and banish a card. Oh no! <laughs> also, at the end of the battle phase of this card, destroy the monster by battle. Uh, target one card in the graveyard, banish it face down. When they're face down, you cannot do anything with them. I know. Mario, you put me in a tough place here. Which, which is the better one, Zylo? Which one's the better one? <laughs> <laughs> the bait is real. Pendulum back. Bring them back. <laughs> I don't care. Oh, do you have multiple of them? Because now I can activate Metal Force Fusion. I mean, uh, look, I'd actually rather fight that than you taking a beside just out of my grave. So I made a call. I'm sticking by it. I, I knew the fusion was going to come out. I knew it. Oh, let's see. Oh, double piercing. Nice. That is cutting it real close. This is a good duel. <laughs> 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 oh, 
Well, I need to beat you this turn, right? Yep. Funny thing is, I can't. Because I have I have my defensive measure right now. Mhm. Mm you know what we're gonna do here? Um. So I'm gonna beg. I'm gonna beg to see if I got anything. I don't got anything, man. So, I'm gonna, it doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. Mario, don't do this to me. <laughs> <laughs> I think you just won. Actually, are we gonna do it like this? Um, well, there's one thing I can do here to see if I can get anything here. Oh, but that also seals you too. Yep. Well, I didn't have anything big to do. Uh... Hello there. Yeah, there it is. I knew that was coming <laughs> Woo! when I saw that. Woo! All right, well, I'm going to set it. You're going to know exactly what it is. If you got something for it, you're going to have it. Um, so I might as well just play what I can play here. We're going to normal summon your boy Neptibus. Activate him. Go ahead. And actually, I didn't even need that play. You want to know why? Why? Because just since I got Neptibus on the field right now, we're going to go ahead and just clear this thing before it comes back to bite us. going to send him to the graveyard so I can destroy one face-up monster. And to my hand, uh, let's see. Now that's not going to do anything. So what we're going to grab is one of these marksmen. And let's say goodbye to you, sir. And when he's sent to the grave, I can ah, target one on. on the field and destroy it. Okay. Like. Yeah, I think that choice is pretty obvious. Alright, so you just need to summon one thing, Mario, and you're in good shape. One thing that can be 800. Alright. They can deal over 800, 300 attack. Yeah. You just need 300 life points of damage. Your little guy on the field right now can't do it. Hmm. I mean, a lot of things can do it. So. Yeah, I kind of wish I had them in the in the in the extra deck right now. Oh, you only got the guy with zero attack points in there. I didn't even realize that. <laughs> wow. Yeah, the rest of them are in the grave. What a game! <laughs> what a game this is. But let's activate Metaphor's combination. Go for just it. Just so I can use that target. Oh, uh, draw something, man. Draw something. Is that what's about to happen here? Yeah. Yeah. From your deck. Oh! Okay, and I guess you can still summon, right? Oh, you went for that. Okay. And then use Metaphos counter and add a Mont card to my hand. Okay. Volflame. Nice, nice, nice. Special summon Volflame. Alright, Mario. You're gonna force me to Torrential Tribute! <laughs> What the? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Torrential tribute's so good in my deck, though. All right, cause now I think it's over. Call the Atlanteans. Get these three out here. And you know what comes after this. Oh, Mario! What a game! Since I made sure to get rid of that dude who was messing with my graveyard. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna just make sure there ain't no shenanigans here. We're gonna go ahead and twin twisters. Get your counter and something else out here. Uh, let's get that middle card. Is that a bad play? <laughs> yeah, that was a bad play. It's not over yet. Oh, okay. When that goes away. Oh, that was a bad play. Oh really? <laughs> what the heck? Kill happened? yourself? <laughs> oh my trap! That's right. That's what my trap does. Of all the ways we could have ended this duel. Oh, <laughs> uh, and I wasn't even worried too, because you know what my last face down was? <laughs> what? Storming mirror force. Oh uh, well, I was about to clear all the spells and traps on the field by bringing up. Yeah, Sandra. so. 
anything I, was a move. I had at another that point. call the Atlanteans on the field. Even if you just got rid of Deep Sea Diva, I would have brought monsters back. I would have been okay. But <laughs> yeah, wow, <and> then... <laughs> I like this. I like this video. It's a long video, isn't it? I believe so. Well, guys, hopefully but... you enjoyed this super long video of Yu-Gi-Oh Fight Club. Any final remarks, Mario? Dinosaurs would have done better. <laughs> Dinosaurs would have done better. Oh, man, I was at least able to bait you out. I actually did have a solemn, I'm not going to lie, but the first time I said it, I didn't. I got the solemn the first quick time, after. Are you kidding me? I could have finished have you off right so early. Beginning. I didn't have it. I could have finished you so <laughs> Once early. Once again, I, I don't lie much, but when I do, it works. I could have brought out the, the, twin, so the twin axe guy and just started yes. dealing piercing damage, yes. piercing damage. <laughs> yes, you could have. <laughs> Mario, when uh, I well, play, it me... it's just as much in your head as it is on the field. I, I'm also a little. I'm also kind of salty. I have three of the field spells in my deck, and I did not draw one. If I had yeah, it on the field, and you would have activated torrential, if yeah, I would have had that on the field, torrential, yeah, yeah, because oh, my monsters would have been unaffected. Yeah, I was like no. sitting there, like, up. Oh, I don't care. He's gonna bring out a monster off torrential. And then I was like, oh, you only have a zero attack point monster anyway. Oh, well, that's cool. <laughs> and then you ended up working your way around it, making it happen. Good duel, Mario. It the metaphors is not the fastest, but once you can get their combos going, I like good. I like the combos, and you, like both of us, we constantly are refreshing our hands. So we both have, in a way, similar decks. Um, but because we are not in the best position, and no, the worst person, and the and the per and the worst thing is, Zylo put me in this position. I did, and I'm glad I did. Because if you had dinosaurs right now. <laughs> I mean, I might have re-rolled into something better, but who knows? Who knows? <laughs> when he got, oh, when he man, Mario, I hope to see you in the finale of this season. Uh, I'm it's hoping I can make great. it to the finals at least. It's always yeah, great, but... yeah. Both of us are going to have an uphill battle to do this. But guys, you remember the first rollback Fight Club. Always talk about Fight Club. If you have enjoyed this, get a pinky on the like button. My side, go over to Mario's side, check out his Fight Club stuff as well. Because we are both climbing with some decks and trying to do our best to climb our way into the season, even though... It might be a little harder than last time. Um, but hopefully you all have a wonderful day. Have a good night. And we'll see you.